Article 1, Section 8 of the U.S. Constitution states that Congress has the power to declare war. So a question that often comes up is, how many times has Congress officially declared war? Despite being in a number of different conflicts over the past two centuries, America has only officially gone to war five times. The first official declaration of war happened in 1812 under the presidency of James Madison. Pressured by the British and the young war hawks in Congress, Madison went in June that year and asked for the declaration of war. That conflict with the British lasted about three years, and although the actual outcome was a stalemate, it gave America a moral victory, especially when Andrew Jackson beat the British at the Battle of New Orleans after the treaty to end the war had been settled. The second official declaration of war is probably the least well known, and that's the Mexican-American War of the 1840s, under the presidency of James Polk. Polk wanted control of the Southwest, especially California. Mexico did not want to give that up. So he sent troops down to the Rio Grande River, antagonized the Mexicans, who finally threw the first punch, which allowed Polk to retaliate. By the time Congress heard that Americans had been attacked by Mexicans down in Texas, they gave the go-ahead for war. The third official war was the Spanish-American War in 1898 under the presidency of William McKinley. There was an international incident when the USS Maine exploded in Havana Harbor. Probably was an accident, but Congress believed enough that it was an attack. And within a matter of weeks, the Spanish were routed over Cuba and eventually other Caribbean Pacific territories. The fourth and fifth and final times the US Congress declared war was World War I and World War II. In both cases, the United States joined the Allies to fight against German aggression although the circumstances were much different in both cases. In World War II, the Japanese actually provoked American involvement in the war, but everyone really knew it was coming for a couple of years by that point, in December of 1941. So why, you might ask, has America been involved in so much military conflict if Congress has only declared war five times? Well, that's a bigger question, which we'll look at in another video on presidential war-making power. If you have any questions, let me hear them, and subscribe for more USA History Blog.